It's a beautiful Monday morning here in Las Vegas for Mobile Beat 2014. Um, Got to go get breakfast at Denny's here in a little bit to kind of wake up. Uh, I've already doubled my money uh, in the casino here. I put five bucks into a uh, slot machine, uh, spun it once, it said I won six bucks, and uh, so I cashed out. <laughs> I'm already ahead. Uh, last night, uh, I ran into a bunch of other DJs at the, one of the casino bars and spent some time having some drinks with them. Oddly enough, they're all from Minnesota and Wisconsin, so who would, who would have known that I would need to come all the way to Las Vegas to meet people in my own backyard? Um, but uh, all in all, I'm looking forward to today. Uh, and I'm excited. Well, it's about a uh, quarter after two this afternoon. Um, I've been through two seminars now. One was the anatomy of an interaction where uh, Dean Carlson uh, talked about uh, what uh, should go into an interaction, why you should do interactions, uh, kind of the, the heart and soul of interactions, giving them a purpose and so on. Um, it really made me think about uh, why I do the interactions that I do and uh, how I can improve that and, and give pretty much everything a purpose. Uh, the next uh, session that I, I went through uh, was uh, 40 interactions in 60 minutes, or 40 games in 60 minutes, and uh, they talked about all sorts of different game ideas for interactions. Um, some of them were pretty silly, uh, others uh, I think uh, had merit and, and uh, are something that I can integrate into uh, my uh, performances um, with it. Uh, some fun ideas for table dismissal games, uh, kids games, kids interactions, uh, so on. Um, but I'm learning a lot, taking a lot of notes. Uh, I'm really going to have to kind of uh, chew on everything I've learned uh, and think about how to apply it to, to what I'm doing. Uh, so uh, all in all, uh, so far with the first two, I'm uh, really glad that I came. And I'm looking forward to uh, some more of the other sessions and seminars and uh, the keynote speakers yet to come. Well, I ran into Jason Jones here at Mobile Beat. Uh, hey. want to... Tell me uh, what you're thinking so far. Uh, I think it's awesome. I uh, love it. Cool. I love, I love seeing everybody. The best part is is that you, you, you always pick up something new, but and, all, and if you don't pick up something new, you'll probably be reminded of something you should have started that you forgot about. Now, uh, are, you, are you presenting here at all this week? Or? I'm not presenting this week. Nope. nope, not this time. Doing anything? Uh, we do have a great workshop. Anything fun or We're crazy? a great party tomorrow night. It's super secret, though. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> now, uh, you, you do a workshop outside of Mobile here, right? Yep. What's yep, it called? The Entertainment Experience. Uh, I want to say anything about that? Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's an incredible transformative experience that I think that everybody should do. Awesome. Uh, where can they find more information about that? Buildcreates.com. <laughs> right. Thanks, Jason. Yeah. Well, decided to come down to Treasure Island uh, just down this trip for a buffet with several other DJs. Uh, one of them happened to be uh, Dean Carlson, the DJ that I uh, heard speak this morning about. Uh, having an impactful uh, interactions, and so I'm going to interview him here. All right. Can I just have you uh, say who you are? My name, my yeah. name is Sven. <laughs> I am Dean Carlson. I'm the owner of Night Magic Productions out of uh, North Branch, Minnesota. So, Dean, uh, today you did a uh, seminar, Mobile Beat. What was it about? Uh, my seminar was called The Anatomy of Interaction. We dealt with all the different body parts that correlate to actually what we do uh, doing interaction on you know, a show-by-show -show basis, for sure. We talked about the soul, uh, you know, which is uh, the purpose that you do your interactions for, your mind, which is knowing everything that you need to do. Uh, we talked about the lips, which are going to you know, bring the interaction to life. We talked about your heart, which is all about love. We talked about the legs, which is the mechanics of interaction, which is uh, you know, another important piece overall. And the hands, which is all about practice. So it was a great seminar. Uh, I enjoyed doing it. We got a full house today. How long have you been coming to Mobile Beat? Um, I have done eight Mobile Beats in the last ten years. I missed last year, and I missed the first year that I was started working on Pro Summer. Like now, uh, what would you recommend to any DJs that weren't able to make it? Uh, for where they can go to get, get training and so on to better themselves? Well, there's a couple of different opportunities that you can use for training. Um, there are some big-name presenters that come around and they have workshops. Um, Bill Herman, Jason Jones, they're from the Twin Cities area, and they do a uh, workshop called the Entertainment Experience. Uh, it's, it will cost you a little bit of money to do that, but it is fantastic. Mark Farrell, who I've been to his workshops, are called the Marbecca. Uh, that's his wife, Rebecca, and his name Mark, Marbecca. 
and uh, they do a love story workshop and they do a master of ceremonies workshop, both of which are outstanding. And I would start with the master of ceremonies class out of all three of those for sure, and, and then work my way on to that. Uh, you can also do some training this fall in, if you're in Minnesota. The uh, Disc Jockey News is putting on a big conference in November, and all of the authors that write for the Disc Jockey News are going to be speaking at this conference. People like Mike Walters, who owns a giant multi op in New York City. Ron Ruth, who is about 8,000 years old and lives in Kansas City, but he's great, I have to tell you. Uh, myself, I'll be presenting at that conference too. So it'll be a fantastic conference. So that's another place that you can go and get further education. Um, you can also go look online if you'd like. That's a little bit more difficult, I think, because you really got to sort out the good and the bad. I mean, there's a lot of people that do Facebook stuff, or uh, YouTube stuff, I should say. But again, it's hard to find you know, which ones are the quality. The people that are putting out the most quality ones are not doing stuff on Facebook. You know, they're going to charge you because they're going to give you something, you know, in return. Um, you know, whatever you put into something, you're going to get back tenfold. Free, not going to get back as much. So, yeah. All right. Thank you. Is that it? We have uh, Brian Red here from uh, Milwaukee, right? Yeah. He's up in my neck of the woods, uh, up in the Wisconsin, Minnesota area. Midwest. Yeah, Midwest. Uh, how long have you been coming to Mobile Beach? 2008 was my first year. Okay. What would you recommend for any DJs out there that have yet to come? Uh, would you advise coming? Or? It depends on, you know, these shows are all kind of what you put into it, you get out of it. If you come expecting, you know, the magic answer to all your problems, you're probably not going to find it, but if you come willing to learn and you come, you know, optimistic and open-minded, you get a lot out of it. And I don't do the seminars so much. I like to just network with the people who come to the show. I feel like it, the best nuggets, like sitting at the bar talking to DJs, other than, you know, the seminars. There are some good ones, you know, but I'm not a seminar guy. I got an attention span of about five minutes. And if I can't reject it for five minutes, you lose me. So there's no way I can sit through a 45 minute seminar unless it's very interactive. So yeah, this is probably you know, my best bet. Just hanging out and, and talking to DJs. But it's good, it's good in that regard. Cool. What well, what brings you here this year? Are you with any group or organization? I, you know, I come every year and, and I just kind of say hi to everybody, see what's going on. Here to support the community. Uh -huh. um, I you know travel with ADJ a lot. But, you know, this year is just kind of a show year. Cool. Now, you've got a pretty active YouTube channel yourself. Uh, what, what exactly do you, do you cover on there? Everything. I mean, lighting, whatever. I vlog a lot. I do not only product reviews, more like little short demos on products, lighting, sound stuff, what have you. And then I also try to throw the, the nugget in there every once in a while before rent's mixing this general philosophy or you know, theory on, on what we do. Cool. This is what I think. It's take it or leave it. All right. Cool. Well, it was uh, a pleasure meeting you here, and I uh, look forward to uh, talking to you. Are you going to be at the ADJ or booth at all for the exhibiting? Or? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be in there a little bit. I'll, I'll be all over the place. I'm everywhere. Cool. It's not hard. I'm just, you know, my hair is bright blonde. So not naturally, unfortunately. But yeah, just, just flag me down here. Yeah. Excellent. Thank you. So we're at the DJ event planner uh, company party up in the Pantel Suite in the Tower of the Riviera. <laughs> and and who do I run into? I run into uh, Ella Skins from YouTube here. Uh, he's pretending to be asleep. <laughs> so, uh, can you tell me a little bit, a little bit about yourself? I am Jonathan. My name is Jonathan, known as the DJ Tutor. More importantly, I am a bloke, a geezer, all right, <laughs> I can't say that, <laughs> who uh, loves all my kids, loves my family, like to teach and inspire people and motivate, but you guys out there, you've got to do the shit you want to do. When someone says you can't do it, it means you can. If someone says don't do it, just as long as it's not, of course, illegal, do it. Be who you want to be. Do what you want to do, say what you want to say, and drink beer. Because I'm drinking beer at the moment, and I'm having a whale of a time. And I'm here with two crazy guys. One's called Gene. How are you? 
Uh, sorry, and <laughs> Rich, DJ Rich, 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 yeah, DJ exactly. Yeah. And we're ju we're just having a really good time. So, at the moment in Vegas, uh, I'm not working at the moment, but it's party time. If you've never heard of the Mobile Beat Show, you should come here because it's a great way of communicating, having, you know, getting tips and tricks from a lot of other DJs, and of course seeing lots of kit. But the main thing is is the communication with other DJs, etc. And so we're going to end the night, day one, Mobile Beat, with the phrase, practice, practice and enjoy. enjoy.